In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at how you can use the object selection tool in Affinity Photo 2. So I have my picture here, and if you've never used the object selection tool before, it might ask you to install a plugin, which is totally free by the way, and you can do so by going to edit, and then choosing settings, and then settings, you choose machine, machine learning, and there you can install segmentation, which will allow you to use the object selection tool as it says here. Now when you've done that, you can go to your toolbar and then we have the object selection tool here, which doesn't have a shortcut key. Uh, but if you select this one, as you can now see, when I hover on top of something, it selects what I'm hovering above. Now, sometimes it doesn't select what you want to select, which you can then try to adjust by holding down the other option key. So then it will make try to make a better selection for you and if you if it selects two things at once you can hold down the older option and shift key combined and then it will just select the only thing you're hovering on top of so not pressing any key it's it does its best to select what you're hovering on top of if you want a finer selection then you can use the older option key while you hover and if you want to even make your selection finer than that, you press the other option and shift key together. And as you can see now, first it se selects this entire strawberry. If I hold the other option and shift key together, it just takes the strawberry without the greenery on top of it. And that's how you can easily use the ob object selection tool in Affinity Photo 2. Like the video if you liked it, subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. And as always, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.